Termination of the keystones from Telegardner is very straightforward. There's no tools necessary to do the termination as there are toolless jacks. Um, basically all we need is a basic uh, uh, wire cutter, as you can see here, which should have a straight edge. Or even we can use a simple tool like a nail clipper, which also has a straight edge. So you can use basically any old wire cutter or any uh, uh, nail clipper to uh, do the termination. Uh, it's pretty straightforward. So what we are going to do is I'm going to remove everything and then we are going to focus on the unshielded termination process to see how easy it is. So I'm going to open the contents of the pack. As mentioned before, there is two keystones per uh, pack. So we have now one set of keystones set aside. Um, what we do is basically we take our cable, we strip four millimeters of the cable uh, from the uh, from the jacket. Very straightforward. Uh, we cut the extra Kevlar cable that we have. We fold the. Um, wires back and we remove the uh, cross membrane from the uh, from the uh, from the uh, cable itself flush set aside we look at our dressing our dressing here on this presentation as you can see here is the 568b standard so i will be following that in uh, telegardner solutions uh, we always have the stripe uh, of the pair on the outside and then we have the um, solid inside. So what I will do is we will have the orange and then the blue uh, here in the lower portion, and then we will have the blue and the green on the on the upper portion of the of the cable itself. So um, I'm going to um, open the cable. Very straightforward. I make sure that I put this strap on the outside. Now I'm going to go to the orange one. And I did the same thing. Now we are good to go. Uh, what we do is before we insert into the jack in order to make life easy, we have to cut the cables in diagonal. So that's exactly what I will do. I use my wire cutter, I use the straight edge, and I will cut in a diagonal. As you can see, the cable is cut in the diagonal. Now we can easily insert it into the jack itself. And it is inserted now into the jack, as shown here. Very, very simple process. The next process is to put the tie wrap into the, uh, into the jacket. The tie wrap goes from the back hole, as shown here, into the jacket into the, ja uh, the lower portion of the keystone uh, to secure the ja jacket of the cable. We make sure the lock is on the back side, as shown here. So it's put in the back side. We bring the cable as close as possible to the body of the keystone. And we tie the uh, tie wrap down. Then we use our wire cutter and we will cut from the straight side of the wire cutter the extra portion of the uh, tie wrap. The next phase is to untwist the uh, upper pairs which are blue and then the green. We will dress into position the, the cables. And you can see now it's easily, you can work with the cable with, with ease and with, uh, with no specific issues because it's tied. We'll place the strap on the outside and then solid in the inside. All right. As you can see now, our process is complete. The next step is to remove the extra cable from the from the keystone itself, and we use the straight edge of the uh, of the uh, uh, wire cutter, and we start cutting away uh, with ease. 
so we can see how easy it is. Upper portion finished, as you can see. We go to the lower portion. We have com just completed the termination of the cable from the lower portion. Now all we need to do is to take the upper portion and put it on the keystone and we are good to go, as you can see here. It's complete.